prom season has officially started here in Mid Michigan. And Nicole, I have a question for you. Okay. I have an answer. How much oh, wait, are you asking me to prom? <laughs> I'm asking Colton's a problem. I already okay. told you that because he had that white tuxedo. Oh, that's right. That's so right. Okay. Anyone, I'm going to prom with anybody. It's Colton. Okay. Uh, but my actual question for you is how much do you think the average prom dress costs? Oh, my gosh. I don't want to know. I know that it was a steal that all three years that I went to prom, I mm -hmm. got it under $100. Oh, so, my gosh. That is a steal. I know. I know. I'm, that's really good. I'm pretty frugal. Okay. So. Well, so am I. But luckily, I did pageants. So I'm yeah. sure I got my money's worth. Okay. Yeah. But, um, but I'm, I'm sure it's probably over $100 average. Well, you're right. It has gone up. <laughs> I'll say that in 2013. That was when we graduated. I yeah. graduated mm -hmm. high school. High school. Uh, the average prom dress was $150 and up, which is true. My purple prom dress was about 200 So was my black and gold one. Mm -hmm. But today, the average price has gone up to about 300 to oh. $700, depending on where you live. Mm -hmm. And if you think about it, that's without alterations and hair costs and mm -hmm. shoes and makeup and nails and all the other things that go into, you know, spending money the limo. Oh, yeah, everything. To all make of it that that goes into the big night. Yeah, so uh, thankfully there are places that can help you or your loved one find that perfect dress, but without breaking the bank, but mm -hmm. still making you feel extra special. So mm -hmm. Claudia has outlined some options for us, so take a look. I do remember my prom, yes. And the dress was very important. For the American team, prom is one of the most important nights of their high school career. It's a time for making memories, and for seniors, it's a time for reflection. Because once prom is done, most teens will trade in their prom dress and tux for their cap and gown. But prom is expensive, and the price is only going up. I feel like right now everything's expensive, so it's not really shocking anymore. <laughs> So let's break down those costs for a female student attending Lansing High School today. A new or gently used prom dress itself can be anywhere from $150 to $700. So let's say that we find a dress right in the middle for $300. Shoes will cost anywhere from $50 to $100 on average, but we found shoes for $60. If we take an average hair updo price from about five local hair salons, we get an average of about $80 bucks for hair, not including a tip. And most girls get their nails done. The average price of pedicures and manicures combined is about $100. The prom ticket itself costs 50 bucks. So when you add all of that up together, you get a total of just under $600. And remember, this doesn't include dinner, corsages, makeup, or tips. For a lot of families, these costs break the bank, but they don't have to. Honestly, I got into it because I couldn't afford my daughter's prom dress. Rebecca with Ever After Opportunities knows how it feels to be in that position. She wanted her daughter's prom to be one to remember, and it was such a relief when she found a dress at a local dress giveaway. She was so thankful that she started volunteering there, eventually forming Ever After Opportunities, a support system for the community, by the community. You know, the need is so great right now in society. Parents are working two and three jobs to be that connection for those girls is just one of the most amazing parts of Ever After. Ever After Opportunities offers gently used prom dresses and accessories right inside the Lansing Mall. Girls can come in and look through beautiful selections of prom dresses, shoes, and accessories for no cost. They are open Tuesday and Thursday from 5.30 to 7 p.m. and on Saturdays from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. No appointments are needed. For those looking to spend a little more, Fantastic Finds in East Lansing has great options as well. Another great place to look in your local area is thrift stores and Facebook Marketplace. Very pretty. Those, are Those dresses, dresses are gorgeous. I like the last one that she was wearing, that uh, navy blue one that had the diagonal. Yeah, like the. Uh, what do you want to call that? Beading. Yes. That wrapped around the entire mm -hmm. dress on the way down. That was a light blue. So you kind of see that two-tone blue yeah. color. I love that. I love it. It's just so cool that this happens right this here in our community. Right yeah, I know. And if you'd like to donate, Ever After is always taking donations as well, and you can find out how to do that at wilex.com. Mm -hmm.